On this week's Spotlight Music Series, we want to check in with our good friend, Miss Lauren Hall, singer-songwriter here in the Low Country, who has been out and about performing, but she's also taking a, a little bit of a hiatus. We're going to get to that in a minute, but she's got a big announcement that a big single is coming out next month, which we're all very excited to hear. First and foremost, Lauren, how have you been doing? Thank you guys so much for having me on the show. I've been doing well. Thank you guys so much. It's yes. been weird not to be playing as much, but I'm excited to release the single and do the release show next week. Or Well, I know the last time that we spoke <laughs> that you were talking about what a fruitful time this was actually for you as an artist because you got to sit down, you got to write, you got to think about your music. And so now audiences are getting ready for the release of your latest single. When is that coming out? Yes, it's coming out next Friday on September 4th, and we're doing a release show at the Holy City Drive-In, so I'm excited to get back out and play. We're doing a full band show at this uh, event as well, so it'll be fun to get the band back together and celebrate the release. But it, uh, We've got a pre-save campaign going on right now, so if people want to go pre-save the song early, I have the link posted on my website and socials. Fantastic, and we're going to get to hear about that song after the break. But I want to talk about the itchy feet that you and a lot of your peers had during COVID because while it was a good incubation time, creatively speaking, you couldn't wait to get back out there and perform for audiences. But it's a little bit of a, a fine line that you have to walk there because while this is what you do and you need to get out there in front of audiences to perform, uh, you can't always count on the audiences to behave themselves. So maybe you could tell us a little bit about what it was like coming back into performing live and why you've decided to maybe slow down just a little bit during this time. Yeah, I've, it's really, it's different for everybody with different situations, but I think as musicians, we, you know, our job is to go and entertain people and help them have a good time. And I think when we were all kind of told, well, you can go out now, just try to social distance you know, everybody just wants to go out and have a fun time because we've all been cooped up so long. So, you know, for me, it's been hard to just find gigs that are fitting for me. And I, I'm i trying to be safe about it because I don't, as a vocalist, you don't want to get it. You don't want to promote people spreading it either. So it's just been a, a fine line of figuring out what gigs are safe and which ones maybe aren't as safe for whoever and whatever your situation is. But it's hard because, you know, we're entertainers and we we love to be around groups of people and we love to have people gather and connect with people that way. So I've missed it a lot. I, I'm i trying to play every now and then, hopefully have more shows lined up in the fall if things kind of calm down a little more around here. But I am excited. We have that show coming up next Friday. That's going to be really fun. The Holy City Drive-In, they've been doing a great job with keeping everybody distance, everyone's in their cars, you can have lawn tickets, and they've got food vendors. It's just a really good setup for what's going on right now. Yeah, absolutely. So this is a lesson for all you audiences out there. Admire from afar. <laughs> Don't go up into their face. Don't say how much you love them. They can, they can hear you from six feet away, if not more. <laughs> we, we love our listeners, just we gotta, we gotta, you know, be, we got to keep you safe, Lauren, so that you can have more years and, and more yeah, music coming out. Tech the pipes, you know? <laughs> absolutely. Absolutely. Well, I want to thank you so much, Lauren, for coming on and sharing all this wonderful news with us. So we're going to be coming up after the break with your performance. Don't go anywhere. <laughs> 